seem to have lost their feathers. They're being kept warm thanks to the efforts of a knitting club from Somerset. This is all true. Battery hens can lose their plumage because of the conditions that they're kept in. So a charity that rescues them put out an appeal for special jumpers. A group in Moncton Heathfield needed no egging on. <laughs> they got hold of the pattern and picked up their needles. Well, Glennon has more. Good little chick. Do there you are. Oh, oh, okay. oh, Dorothy. Oh, Isn't she she's smart. Smart. Oh. Dorothy was a battery hen who's now retired and rescued. But like so many of her sisters, she lost a lot of feathers during her life in a cage. She now needs a jumper to keep her warm while they regrow. And this knitting group was only too willing to help. We had a lady who came into the shop. She just handed me a pattern. And I can't remember who she is, so she's out there, thank you. Um, and then the whole garden centre just took it up as a really good cause um, because it is knitting jumpers for little chickens who've been basically got to the end of their working life as a battery hen and they really want to just um, roam free but they are a little bit feather free so they're very cold. The chickens wear the jumpers for about two weeks. It doesn't matter what colour they are, any bits of scrap wool will do. They used to knit baby blankets for the hospital here so this is a new departure. Seeing the hen today that uh, our lady brought in to, to show us the next battery hen, it really does feel like a good cause, yeah. The hens apparently like a tight sweater, otherwise they can get their feet caught. Chicken charities say they need plenty of jumpers, and this lot are pleased to help. After all, it's a great way to recharge a battery hen. Will Glennon, BBC Points West. Oh.